Hello Cloud Gurus and welcome to AWS This Week. I've got some great announcements to tell you about this week. AWS Code Build adds support for .NET Core on Windows. Amazon Translate is now supported in the AWS Mobile SDK for both Android and iOS. Application load balancers add built-in authentication. Early bird tickets are still available for serverless con San Francisco. And we announce our Guru of the Week. You're watching AWS This Week with me, Julian Pittis. AWS CodeBuild, the automated code building pipeline solution, now supports .NET Core 2.0 on Windows. This allows .NET Core developers to build their code in a Windows environment with Windows-based build tools. Previously, CodeBuild only supported .NET Core on Linux. CodeBuild doesn't yet support the .NET framework natively, however, the AWS team have provided documentation to create a custom Docker image to work around the issue. Amazon Translate is supported in the AWS Mobile SDK. Amazon Translate is Amazon's neural machine translation service that provides on-demand translations. Android and iOS developers can now use the Mobile SDK to provide real-time translations, supporting things like real-time chat between two different languages in chat applications. The Mobile SDK provides code samples, making it even easier for developers to consume the service. The AWS Application Load Balancer, or ALB, now supports built-in authentication. For those of you who aren't familiar with ALB, it's a type of load balancer that operates at the application layer seven of the OSI model. ALBs allow you to route your users based on path or host. And now ALBs can securely authenticate users as they access your application through user-defined rules. Users can sign in with their social identity provider like Facebook, Google, Amazon, or through Amazon Cognito. All authentication and routing is handled by the ALB, reducing repetitive code developers have to write to authenticate users in their application. Early bird tickets are still available for serverless con San Francisco. We're gonna be discussing all things serverless and tickets are flying out the door and prices are rising on June 15th. So get yours before the price increases or even worse, they sell out. So, on to Guru of the Week. The correct answer this week was D and the winner of, and Guru of the Week goes to Josh Bell. So go check out their answer. Congratulations, Josh. You can expect an A Cloud Guru t-shirt, sticker, and hand signed card in the post. And you're also in the draw to win a free ticket to reInvent 2018. Please see the link below for this week's question, which is now live on our Facebook page. And last but not least, A Cloud Guru is looking for instructors. So if you have a passion for cloud, DevOps, security, serverless, programming, or other topics, please visit and apply at acloud.guru forward slash careers. That's all from me. You've been watching AWS This Week. Keep being awesome, Cloud Gurus, and we'll see you next time.